DJ here with the Chief Peak, and today we're gonna to be going through the toughest arms workout I could come up with in 25 minutes. Technically, I think it's 25 minutes and 15 seconds, but you get the point, and that does not include the warm up. So, the warm up is going to add an additional three minutes to the overall workout. So, for the actual workout, we're gonna start with tricep, uh, triceps, and we're gonna do four exercises. Uh, performed in straight sets and we're going to do three sets of each exercise. Then we're going to move on to biceps and we're going to do five exercises for three sets each. Again in straight sets, 30 seconds on, 15 seconds off for triceps and biceps. And then once we're finished with both of those, we're then going to go into a final superset of triceps and biceps. That's two sets each for four total sets trying to burn out there and we're going to be doing a 45 second working time with a 15 second break. If you like this workout, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and let's get to work. All right, we have about 20 seconds until we get started with our warm up. If you have a fitness tracking watch, be sure to start your workout. Now, uh, our first uh, exercise in the warm up we're going into is some very light bicep curls. So I just have some 10 pound Weights right here, and all I'm gonna do is nice, easy curls. Here we go. So we're about to put these arms to work. So first, we gotta warm them up so we don't uh, injure them. Just some nice, easy bicep curls here. Nothing crazy, go at your own pace if you want. You can even alternate, that's totally fine. Just getting them warmed up, getting some blood flow going. After this, we're going into overhead tricep extensions again. Nice light weight, it should not be your working weight. So this is a little bit of half, around half of what my working weight is. Here we go, coming up. I haven't decided if I'm gonna do 20s, 25s, maybe even 30s for the workout. Probably not 30s, I was thinking on a couple of them, but we'll see. Here we go, nice and easy. Keep those elbows up, we don't wanna drop the elbows like that. It's more performing a shoulder press. So elbows nice and high, coming up, back down. Here we go. Next, we're going into arm circles. We're going to drop our dumbbells here. We're we'll sitting down. You can drop them if you want. Here we go. Nice, easy arm circles. Don't forget to breathe. Making some bigger circles here. Here we go. I'm going to reverse. Warming the shoulders up, stretching them out. After this, we're going to go into forearm and bicep stretch. There we go. So all I'm going to do is uh, fingers pointing down, and I'm going to pull on them for just a second. Nice and easy. Go to the other side. There we go. And then all I like to do is put my arm there on the wall, and then kind of feel it stretch out on the bicep. Nothing crazy here. Again, right here like that on the other side. Feeling that bicep stretch out just a little bit. There we go. All right, we're going into some tricep stretches here. Hand up and over, stretching it out. Nothing crazy. You're not really pulling on it super hard here, just, just a little bit. There we go. We've got a pretty good amount of movements for the triceps that are overhead, so definitely want this stretched out. Stretching out that lat too, so it's a little bit easier to get those uh, elbows up in the air. Next, we're going into internal and external shoulder rotations. Here we go. So, arms up, elbows in a 90. Coming down, keeping the elbows up, and then coming back up. There we go. So, here to here. Don't forget to breathe. There we go, nice and easy. There we go, a couple seconds left. Then we got about a 20 second break before we get into the workout. All right, we got about 20 seconds until we start our workout. Our first exercise we're gonna be going into is overhead tricep extension. So let's grab our dumbbells. So what we're gonna do here, bring our dumbbells up. You can rest them on your shoulders. From here, elbows nice and high, extending up, coming back down. There we go. Extending up, coming down. Extending up, 
coming down. Make sure you have a good solid base stance. Slight bend in the knees. Here we go. Don't forget to breathe. Come on, push it out. Remember, we should be reaching failure at some point today. We shouldn't be able to make it through every single set. If you can, you need to go up and wait. There we go. I'm actually gonna go up and wait. <laughs> also, you can use one dumbbell with these if you want. So here we go. Going into set two. Here we go, coming up and up and good controlled movements if it starts to get a little too tough where you start to reach failure drop down use those legs explode up and then control it down explode up control it down there we go Starting to feel better now. We got one more set here. Whew. Also, you can use one dumbbell if you want. You can just grab the end of it, come up and over like that. Here we go. Last set of overhead tricep extensions. Come on. Oh. Triceps are burning. Here we go. Come on. Let's go. Try to keep pushing, work through the burn. Ah, let's go. Come on. Let's go one more. There we go. All right, we got tricep kickbacks coming up next. Woo! Triceps are burning. So you don't need a super heavy weight for this. Make sure that our back is nice and straight. Arms come up by the side. From here, kick them back. Coming back down, kicking back, come back down. If you want, as you come back, you can rotate your palms up or rotate your palms down. You could also just keep your palms, or wrists in that neutral position, which is facing each other. Come on. Push it out. Let's get one more. Here we go. Woo, good reps right there. Keep it up. Let's see if we can keep going. Just gotta keep burning them triceps up. Here we go. Back nice and straight, arms by the side. There we go. Come on. Bam. If you need to, you can always alternate left and right. Just like that, it's totally fine. If you need to take a quick break, you stand up, give it a one, two count, try to come back down, get back into it. Don't take super long extended breaks. There we go. Our goal here is just to keep pumping the muscles full of blood. Here we go. Third set here coming up. Come on. Arms up by the side. Push it. Come on. Here we go. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Let's get it. One more here. Oh, no, we got another. Here we go, we're going to lying tricep extensions. So what we're gonna do here, lay on our back, grab our dumbbells or dumbbell, either one, hands up, there we go. We're gonna come down, bring the dumbbell over our head, tap the ground, come back up. There we go. So if it starts to get too heavy, let them down and then just pull your elbows down. You can do a press back up and then a tricep extension on the way down. Press up, come down. There you go. Set one is done. Turn 
like this. Here we go. A couple seconds. Let's get ready. There we go. As you can see, when I'm coming up, my arms aren't perfectly vertical. They're actually leaned back. And that is to keep tension on the triceps. There we go. Keep pushing. Let's go. One more. Ah. Woo. Triceps are still on fire. Here we go. Going to set three. Come on. Let's go. Coming down, back up. Down, back up. Here we go. Come on, don't give up. Here we go. Oh, a couple more reps. One more. Oh, I don't know how I'm gonna do those. All right, next we're gonna go into close grip push-ups or cobra push-ups. So the nice thing about close grips is that we're also gonna utilize the chest here. So hands nice and close to the body, coming down, back up. When I come down, my hands are just up under my chest. My elbows are pulled in. There we go. This starts to get too tough. Just drop down into cobras. Keep the hips on the ground. There we go. I don't actually know if cobras are any easier at this point. Because my triceps are spare. Woo! Here we go. What's it taking us like? Seven minutes, eight minutes to burn the triceps up? Here we go. Alright, let's get back after it. Come on. Coming down and up. Down and up. Come on. Hey, go to Cobras. Remember to keep those elbows in. We don't want them flaring. Keep the hands in. If you have to, give a little two count break at the bottom. There we go. Last set coming up. Then we get a little extended break. Moving on to biceps. Here we go. Push it. Come on. Don't give up. It's alright to take a little break. It's not okay to stop. Let's do one more. Here we go. Good stuff right there. Alright, we got a little extended break. We're gonna be going in to incline curls. What we're gonna do is utilize the wall. So if you have a wall, hopefully you have a wall, make sure that it's braced. So see how I got an outlet right here? That typically means there's a stud. So I'm going to lean up against that, get my feet way out, let those dumbbells hang. We're going to curl up and down. If you have a chair with no arms, you can also do this sitting in a chair. Here we go. So let's get those feet out away from us. There we go. So what this is allowing us to do is perform curls with the uh, biceps extended or elongated. Come on. Arm and up, squeeze, back down. Up, squeeze, back down. Come on, push it out. Set one is done. Keep 
cushion. Here we go. Let's get up against the wall here. Push it out. Keep pushing. Here we go. Good reps. Keep it up. Good control movements. If you need to, you can always alternate left and right. Again, just don't give up. Here we go. Going to step three here. Keep pushing. Here we go. Grab your dumbbells. Lean up against the wall. Come on. Up and back down. Up and squeeze. Back down. There we go. Come on. Keep pushing. Ten seconds. Here we go. Let's get two more. Last one. Woo! Ooh, arms are pumped up. All right, we got hammer curls coming up next. This time, we're gonna have that neutral wrist position, so palms facing each other. We're gonna stay like that the whole time. So here we go. Coming up, back down, up. Back down, up, and down. Oh yeah, biceps are burning. Come on. Keep pushing it. Come on, try to make it through this whole set right here. We're gonna go one more. There you go, good stuff. Set two. Here we go. Couple seconds. Come on. Focus on the biceps. Every single rep. Just gotta tell them. Grow biceps. Grow. So as you get to your toe, alternate left and right. You can even do a little right, left, and then both. Option like that. One more. Here we go. Set three. Keep pushing. Here we go. Coming up and down. Up and down. Arms are on fire. Come on, keep pushing. You got this. Let's go. One more. Here we go. All right, next going in to drag curls. So this time what we're gonna do is have our palms facing away from us. We're gonna drag the dumbbells up our sides, trying to keep our palms facing out away. There we go. So drag them up. When you get up to the top, get that little squeeze. So drag them up, get that little squeeze. Come on. Keep pushing. Dumbbells don't want to move well anymore. Come on. Woo! Here we go. Remember, it's alright to fail. We should reach failure. Have to take a little break. That's totally fine. But we ain't giving up. That's the key. We ain't giving up. Here we go. Thumbs out. Coming up. Little tiny curl. Drag them up. Little tiny squeeze. Let's go. If you need to, you can try to alternate. Come on. 
Let's go. Oh. Woo. oh, there we go. Starting to have some serious difficulty now. Hmm. Set three, jack curls. Oh, dragging them up, get the little squeeze. Drag up, squeeze. Ah, come on. Remember, embrace that power, and that's what we're here for. Put that smile on your face. One more. There we go. Good stuff. All right. We got concentration curls coming up. We're going to alternate between these left, right, left, right. So get that nice little split stance. Right hand goes on the knee. Let the dumbbell hang. Here we go from here. Curling it up. Coming back down. Curling it up. Coming back down. Come up, squeeze. When you come up, try to get that pinky higher than the thumb. That's called supination. We're rotating the wrist. Come on. Let's go. Control it up, control it down. Don't bring it up and then just let it fall. We don't want to do that. Here we go. Switching sides here. Concentration curl right side. Here we go. Coming up and down. Up and down. There we go. Come on. Push it out. Come on, give it that little squeeze. Ah, come on down. Up and squeeze. Back down. 10 seconds. You gotta keep pushing it. Here we go. I'm actually gonna try to go up and wait here. Here we go. Left side, so I'm gonna up and squeeze. I'm gonna up and squeeze. There you go. Every time you come up, get that little squeeze. Remember, thumb go or pinky goes higher than the thumb here. Good reps. Good reps. One more. Good stuff. Going back to our right side. Here we go. Coming up and down. Up and squeeze and down. There we go. Good controlled movement. Remember, we're controlling it up, controlling down. There we go. All right, we got one set left. I'm actually gonna go up. Let me grab a little 35 here. I was using 25s. I'm gonna go 35s. Push it out. Come on, left side. Coming up. Oh yeah. Down. Up. And down. Come on. Push it. Here we go. Come on. Let's go. 10 seconds. Come on. Let's go one more. I think that was all I had anyways. I thought about trying for another one, but I don't think it was coming back up. Here we go. Right side. Come on. Come on up. Down. Up. Here we go. Push it out. 
Show yourself what you're made of. Come on. Let's go. Keep pushing. Let's get two more. One more. Woo, there we go. Good stuff. All right. We got a little break here. And then we're going in to lying tricep extensions. The cheat. The cheat kind. So use some heavier weight. That's not a bell for anything. That's called operator error when putting in sounds. So don't worry about it. Here we go. I'm going to grab some heavier dumbbells than the last time. Even though our arms are exhausted, but that's okay. That's what we want. Here we go. So again, we're going to come down. If it gets too heavy, drop down, push up. Just like that. Here we go. Let's get ready. Hands up. Coming down. Try to push these out until you get exhausted. We want to reach exhaustion here. We got 45 seconds on. So we should be able to do that. Come on. Let's go. We're doing both arms here. We're not going to alternate. Come on. Again, if you need to. Come down, pull the elbows down, push up, get the extension. Come on. Oh, there we go. Woo! Here we go. That was my breaking point right there. Except, guess what? We have 45 more seconds of that coming up right here. Five seconds. Hands up. Coming down and up. Come on, push it out. You got it. We are quitters. Let's go. Come down. Push up. Negative extension. Down. Get the negative. Here we go. Come on. Good controlled movement. Remember, you're dropping the dumbbells above your head, not on your head or beside your head. Keep those elbows in. Press up. Come down. There we go. Good stuff. All right. Next, we're going in to alternating close curls. So, again, heavy dumbbells, heavier dumbbells. We're going to bring them across our body right here. Here we go. 45 seconds coming up, back down, up, back down. Come on. Up and squeeze. Up and squeeze. Let's go. Good control movements. If maybe your dumbbells are a little too easy or light, and this is too easy, put them together. Bust out a bunch of reps, as many reps as you can, both arms at a time, doing just close curls like that. Here we go. Come on. And then once you're exhausted doing that, go back to alternating close curls. Here we go. Come on. One more. All right. I'm going to go up and wait. I'm going to grab some 30s. Before long, I'm going to pull out my whole dumbbell rack right here. Here we go. Alternating close curls. Come on. Let's see what we got. Let's go. Push it out. Keep going. Come on. 20 seconds. Keep going. We're not done yet. Not uh, we ain't finished. Keep pushing. Let's go. All 
Ah, come on. Let's go. Let's try for 15 more seconds. There we go. One more each arm. One more, last one. Ah. Woo! Oh, I can barely clap. That's what we're talking about right there. Way to push it through that workout. Woo! Now it's time. Go check out, check out your arms in the mirror. Enjoy. Enjoy it. <laughs> All right, I hope you guys enjoyed that workout. If you did, be sure to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you on the next one. See you guys.